Well, how do there, charms to I, Captain of Steves, and I'm just loading into No Man's Sky to continue on doing the living ship quest, and I'm hoping the neural stem has finished. By the looks of things, it may have done. Okay, well, let's have a look, see, shall we? So let's go into the old inventory. Yes, I believe it has. I think it's ready. Lovely. Jubbly. I guess. Right, well, I guess we better move on with the next part of the mission. Let's have a look, see. Log, star birth. I wait contact. I fulfilled the request of the void egg as best I can understand it. I should wait further contact from the egg. Okay, well, let's um jump into the old ship. And I guess what I should do is either start pulsing again. I don't know whether I'm going to have to jump systems before I start pulsing. Oops, wrong button. Let's, um, let's just pulse and let's see what happens. I think what I might have to do is, is re-engage Pulse now that I'm in space, away from the planet. I'm going to Pulse past the station. Here we go. And let's see if it hits me up in this system. I might have to jump to another part of the galactic map. Oh, hold on. Yeah, this is the egg sign again. So here we go. Quick menu. Hello there, my living shippy friend. The Metal Masters, bind us no more. We are free. We may swim, fly, live and die. The void egg quivers as the litting up music of the alien ship fills my cockpit. It's a motion of recognition, except transmission. The song of the ship, the creature, fills my starship, spilling from circuit to circuit, flooding the computer. As the music fades, I hear a faint echo a gently hummed response. The Void Egg. Okay. Alright. Uh, it says there to go to... Quick menu. Going into here. It should be selected current mission, and it is. And we go in there. We're zooming in, and we're going there. Let's go! Tell it how! And away we go, people. Right. Well, we're in another system. Pretty darn sweet. Lovely jubbly. I'm just making sure I'm definitely recording. Yes, I am. Lovely. Right, okay. I can't get over how cool the actual ship looks, you know. The Void Egg seeks a specific world. Examine the egg in the inventory. Okay. Right. Egg inside of my exosuit, of course. Oh, God. Where, where's my egg? It's somewhere in here, people. Eggy, 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 where are you? Maybe I should move it somewhere else. Ah, it wants a dust-covered world of extreme storms. Okay, right. Um, okay, well, we'll better get scanning planets then, better we? Well, it won't be that one. It's not really dusty, is it, that one? Oh, yeah, let's, uh, let's scan. Oh, here we go. Hey, look, it's already put a marker on it. Well, that's cool. Well, I'm going to hit the left trigger anyway, just to see what sort of planet it is. Cactus Flesh, Activated Idiom. Yeah, that'll be the one then. Okay, right, well, we're locked on. Let's go. Zoom! I'll see you down at the planet, people, in the view of us. Like, yeah. Okay, people, well, we've just broke the cloud barrier. Let's zoom on down, shall we? Meow. It's approximate location. I was trying to land me in the oceans there, wasn't it? Right, well, this is very mountainous. I'm going to land at the top of a mountain because it's easier to go down a mountain. Hold on, there's something right here, isn't there? What is this? What is that exactly? Hmm. How peculiar. Right, slow down. I don't know what that is. But it was sticking out the surface a moment ago, wasn't it? Okay, I'll just land over here where it's clear, I think. Great, we're going to have like an extreme storm as well. Let's land. Okay, people. Well, this planet is seriously creepy. S sounds like I just brushed a load of bones or something. What the fudge was that over that hill? Did you see that? 
What the fudge was that? Oh, it's some, some sort of strange flying creature. What the fudge is... There's a giant... Oh, my days. That was a creepy-ass noise. Oh, my... Da look, giant worm. Holy mackerel. There he goes. Jesus. Okay, right. It's lucky those things can't attack us, isn't it? Okay, right. Um, the void egg is humming. Set of coordinates. Use the target sweep. Okay. Well, hopefully it's down the mountain then. Okay. Right, well, it could take me a little while to find where I've got to go to. So I'll go there and I'll reconvene when I get there or if something interesting happens. Whoa, nearly lost my breakfast then. Thank you. Cool, yeah. See you in a mo, people. Chums, I think I have just had the most frustrating time of my life playing No Man's Sky. The size of these mountains, trying to get up them. If I didn't have a flying beetle, I would have been stuffed. Put it that way. This was horrendous. I did not enjoy my time trying to get here. But anyway, let's uh, hit this one up. Archive of Corvax Prime. Retrieval in progress. Log files. Partial success achieved. The bridge allows the implementation of consciousness shards within the discrete shells. Lovely jubbly. Unit remains connected to greater mind. Sensory input fully shared. Attempt to localise sensory inputs cause traumatic desperation. Unfruitful. Suspect biological core required. Root sensory experience in bodily experience to improve stability. You could improve the frickin' word, Edge. System must have local control. Okay, experimental synthesis. Operational, awaiting the biogenesis material. What do you need this time? The plaque replays more data from before the destruction of Corvax Prime. These researchers were building something, a biological shell, an individual manifestation of their own convergent minds. Insert pulsating core. Okay. Brilliant. Lovely jubbly. One of the plans for the novel mods to upgrade the solar ray. Oh, lovely. I've got a solar ray that I can implement. Kate. Lovely. The pulsating cure. Okay, so I need liquid sun and gold. All right, fair enough. Okay, so I guess I need to go into my old inventory. Go over to my multi-tool. And input this new bit of technology. The solar ray. I've got the materials for that, which is lovely. Right. Now to get liquid sun, I need to I need to find like uh, one of these deposits. And I just zap that deposit over the oh, it's, it's locked onto some flying creature at the moment. Yeah, that over there, whatever that is. I'm trying to, I'm trying to scan that. Yeah, that what is it? Activated idiom. Right, if I mine that out of the ground, I will get liquid sun. Like Koki. Um, right. Well, considering I'm in creative mode, <laughs> I think I'm just going to do it because the terrain here is insanely bad. Okay, I will never find my way back here again if I do that. So here we go. Let's um, go into the old infantry. Go away, gun. Infantry. And we'll go over to my exosuit. Scroll on down a bit. And I'm just going to make it here. So gold, you can get that from shooting asteroids. Not a problem. Liquid sun, you would just use that new bit of technology I just put in my multi -tool, tool on a like a deposit. And it should give you it. There we go. Done. Sweet. Okay. Let's go back over to here then. And let's put in what it wants. Sweet. Insert materials. As a machine begins its work, I feel the egg twitch within my exosuit. Its responsibility for activating these machines is imprint upon the life I am creating. Cool. And we've got to return when that's done. So that's the fragile heart. How long has the fragile heart got to go? I bet it's another 20 odd hours, isn't it? Okay, let's have a look. Yeah. And it's not saying... Oh, there we go. 20 hours, 55 minutes, 8 seconds, people. Okay. Okay. 
All right. Um, I guess that's 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 that then, really, people, isn't it? I just haven't looked if there is a court, uh, like a deposit right near me. There's one that's 164 U's. Let me uh, let me just uh, go over there quickly, and we we'll use the solar ray on that 164 U's this way. I don't think you can tag stuff. Okay, you can tag stuff, but it's it's a little bit finicky. R1. Well, that didn't work. All right, well, we're going over here anyway, in this massive storm. And I just want to dig a little bit out, just to sh look what I mean with the, the terrain. If I slide down there, I'm not getting back up again in a hurry, am I? And this is the problem with this planet. It's just been horrendous. I've had a horrendous time, people. I really have. I'm not, a, I'm not over-exaggerating either. It has been horrible. Okay, so here we go. There we go. Now I'm getting the liquid sun. There we are. And that's that's the other ingredients you would need. The gold you can get from shooting asteroids, like I mentioned before. There's a few things that refine into gold too, like if, you, if you're lucky enough to get those things. But there we go. Right, now I need to try and get back up to where my ship is. And this could be, this is where I kept falling down the mountain, doing myself some harm. I put it in creative mode to stop dying. Now I'm going to try and get back up here. But this is the sort of thing I've been doing. I've just been looking at a rock face for like 30 minutes until I was like, hold on, I'm going to use my beetle. And that helped me no end. Right, my ship's all the way over there. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to call my ship here so I can actually um, save. Yeah, there. I'm going to jump in my ship, out of my ship, and then we'll be pressing on, uh, hopefully, in 20 hours' time with the next step of this building of a living ship. Let's just jump on out. Yep, there we are. Lovely. Oh, there we go. Oh, I've got to send a message by those things. But there we go. That's that, people. That's um, the fragile stem done and we're now doing the fragile heart so that's number 20 hours fragile heart will be ready i mean we've done that in this episode we've got the parts that we needed so until next time people goodbye goodbye and goodbye again thank you